What is going on everybody? Thank you so much for tuning in. My name is John. Today I have for you a big box good. That's right, today we're going to be taking a look at the Mainstays LED Gooseneck Desk Lamp with Catch-All Base and AC Outlet in navy blue I picked up at Walmart for $6.88. Out of 5 stars, this Mainstays LED Gooseneck Desk Lamp gets 5 out of 5 out of 70 customer reviews. It comes in 5 different colors, aqua, black, navy blue, which we have in front of us here today, gray and pink. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing and a first impressions as well as set it up upstairs at my desk where it's a little bit dark just to see how well it works. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the unboxing and first impressions. So as you can see, we've got our LED desk lamp here. It does have a max rating of 260 lumens. It does weigh about 2.8 pounds. It has a length of 5.31 inches, a width of 6.5 inches, and a height of 17.25 inches. So you can get a pretty good idea of how big this desk lamp is. Like I did say at the beginning of the video, it is a gooseneck desk lamp, which is really nice. You can sort of uh, swivel this around, bend it up and down, just to get the exact amount of light you need on whatever you're working on. Let's go ahead and maybe cut off some of the uh, paperwork here and some of the junk that's hanging on the side there. Uh, what I like is the power cord seems to be a pretty decent length here. So uh, maybe I would say that's about a good four foot power cord, which is really nice. So uh, you could definitely set this up at your desk. Uh, not quite sure what that user guide will say, but um, just probably some FCC regulation stuff and don't look directly into the lamp because it is supposed to be pretty bright. Uh, what I like about the back of this desk lamp here is there is an AC outlet, so you don't have to worry about this being a high enough wattage to charge up your tablet or something like that, or even your laptop, for, for example. Because this desk lamp is plugged into the outlet already, uh, you're gonna get a high amount of voltage or as much voltage as you need from this AC outlet in the back here, which is really awesome. So they're advertising this as a long lasting LED light. So you shouldn't have to change the bulb. As you can see, there is no bulb. It's sort of just a flat panel here. Uh, you can really pivot this desk lamp Sort of any way you need it, which is really cool. I've got it off to the side here. Um, you can even sort of bend it off to the side and then tilt the lamp upward. Uh, you do get some venting on the top here or the back of the where the bulb is inserted just to keep that LED light cool. But because LED lights are pretty efficient anyway, you shouldn't really have to worry about this light overheating or getting too hot. Pretty, pretty good stuff. So let's go ahead and install this upstairs. You'll see just how dark my desk area is and we'll see what kind of difference it makes. Okay guys, so here is where I have my computer set up. This is where I do most of my editing work. Uh, when I'm up here early in the morning, it's really dark. And when I'm up here late at night working on something, it's, you know, obviously really dark. Uh, we do have a window here, so during the day, yeah, it does let some light in, but sometimes it's not enough. Uh, as you can see here on the ceiling fan, we do not have a light installed. And if you just take a look above us, we have no recess lighting installed above this sort of uh, living space here where I have my computer set up. But luckily, I was able to move some things around and get the lamp installed to the left of my computer here. Uh, what's really nice is it does light up my keyboard, which is not backlit. So that's really helpful. That's an extremely bright light, by the way. I think I might just position this down a little bit and sort of let it flood over my keyboard. But um, as you can see here, let's just pretend it's dark for a moment. That is doing a fantastic job at lighting 
my desk where I can see my coffee and I can see my keyboard and I can see where the mouse is and I can also see uh, where some cables are so that if I need to plug things in, you know, I can do that. Also, I just wanted to demonstrate here. I do have some sticky notes here, a stack of sticky notes. Go ahead and just rip that off. And as you can see, they sort of fit nicely in that little base underneath the lamp there. Uh, maybe just a little bit too big, but like I said, that's ideal for paper clips, maybe a pen or pencil. Uh, whatever you could fit in there. Anyways, guys, yeah, that desk lamp looks absolutely phenomenal. It does a great job of illuminating everything that I need to see, especially when it's dark up here in the early mornings or at night. And um, yeah, for 688, 260 lumens, it's LED and it has an AC outlet in the back. So if I Theoretically, if I wanted to plug that computer into it, well, actually I couldn't because the outlet in the back is two prong. The computer requires three prongs. Uh, if I wanted to say, plug in my phone to the back of it, I could very much do that. Also, I had, did have a MacBook Pro. That was two prongs. That could plug into the back of this lamp. Say if you have a 13 inch or a 15 inch or a 16 inch or a MacBook Air or an iPad, yeah, they could all be plugged into the back of that lamp to charge, so it does add some versatility. Anyways, guys, yeah, I think this lamp is fantastic. Anyways, guys, that has been an unboxing and a setup and installation of the Mainstays Gooseneck LED desk lamp. I picked up at Walmart for a 688. Out of five stars, it gets five out of five out of 70 customer reviews. Because I picked it up at Walmart, that does make it a big box good. It's a very fine lamp with 260 lumens, a base, an AC outlet at the back so you can plug in a phone, a tablet, or a computer even. Really great value here, really great versatility for any desk space, office space, what have you. If you want to see more reviews like this, hit that like button, subscribe. Once again, thank you so much for tuning in. My name is John. I hope to see you in the next video. For now, thank you so much for tuning in. I will see you in the next one.